Swiss International Airlines AG short Swiss, stylized as Swiss, is the national airline of Switzerland operating scheduled services in Europe and to North America, South America, Africa and Asia. Its main hub is Zurich Airport, with a focus city operation at Geneva Airport. The airline was formed after the 2002 bankruptcy of Swissair, Switzerland's former flag carrier. It was built around Swissair's former regional subsidiary, Crossair. The airline retains Crossair's IATA code LX Swissair's code was senior. It took over Swissair's old ICAO code of SWR Crossair's was CRX, in order to keep international traffic rights. It is a member of the Star Alliance. It is a subsidiary of the Lufthansa Group, with headquarters at Euroairport basel Malouz freiburg near Basel, Switzerland, and an office at Zurich Airport in Kloten, Switzerland. The company's registered office is in Basel. History Beginnings Swiss was formed after the 2002 bankruptcy of Swissair, Switzerland's former flag carrier. Crossair had 40% of its income come from the defunct Swissair. The new airline's losses totaled $1.6 billion from startup until 2005. Swissair's biggest creditors, Credit Suisse and UBS, sold part of Swissair's assets to Crossair, the regional counterpart to the transatlantic Swissair. At the time, both Swissair and Crossair were under the same holding company, called Sair Group. Crossair later changed its name to Swiss International Airlines, and the new national airline started its operations officially on 31 March 2002. The airline was first owned by institutional investors 61.3%, the Swiss Confederation 20.3%, cantons and communities 12.2% and others 6.2%. Swiss also owns subsidiary companies Swiss Sun 100% and Crossair Europe 99.9%. It has a total of 7383 employees. According to Marcel Biedermann, the managing director of Intercontinental Markets for Swiss, there were three possibilities: stay independent as a niche carrier, shrink to an unrecognizable level, or attach onto another airline group. The last choice was taken. Swiss talked to Air France KLM, British Airways, and Lufthansa. However, Swiss was tied up with debt and an uncertain future and seemed to be an unattractive investment. After merging with KLM, Air France said they were too busy to deal with Swiss joining them. British Airways was open, and OneWorld Partners thought Zurich Airport would be a viable alternative hub for London Heathrow. After almost a year of disputes, Swiss was finally accepted into the OneWorld Airline Alliance, after having been blocked by British Airways, which competes with Swiss on many long-haul routes. On 3 June 2004, Swiss announced its decision not to join OneWorld because they did not want to integrate their current frequent flyer program into British Airways Executive Club. Furthermore, Swiss thought the relationship was one-sided, where British Airways sapped out the benefits of the airline, but they would get no return. Recovery <inaudible> <inaudible> The airline annually halved its losses, and in 2006 recorded a net profit of $220 million. The net profit for 2007 was $570 million. Biederman stated in the March 2008 edition of Airways that this was the beginning of getting our house back in order. He said that help was needed and looked up to Lufthansa as a comparison, so their coming together was natural, even with their differences. Even with the smaller network, Swiss carries the same number of passengers as they did in 2002. On the 22nd of March 2005, Lufthansa Group confirmed its plan to take over Swiss, starting with a minority stake, 11% of a new company set up to hold Swiss shares called Air Trust. The Swiss operations were gradually integrated with Lufthansa's from late 2005, and the takeover was completed on the 1st of July 2007. Swiss joined Star Alliance and became a member of Lufthansa's Miles and More Frequent Flyer program on 1 April 2006. The airline has set up a regional airline subsidiary called Swiss European Airlines. This carrier has its own air operator's certificate. The two independently operating divisions Swiss Aviation Training and Swiss World Cargo using the belly capacity of passenger planes are also owned by Swiss. 
Swiss European Airlines renamed to Swiss Global Airlines has since ceased operations and merged with its parent, Swiss. In 2008 Swiss International Airlines acquired Edelweiss Air and Cerver, now Swiss Private Aviation. From February 2011 Swiss Private Aviation ceased to operate as a result of internal reconstruction. The company recommended Lufthansa private jet service as a succedaneum. In 2007, Swiss placed an order for nine Airbus A330 300s to eventually replace the existing A330 200s. The A330 300 is more environmentally friendly and has three class seating. As each A330 300 arrived, an A330 200 was retired from the fleet. The first A330-300 jet was put into service from Zurich to New York JFK in April 2009. In spring 2010 Swiss operated five A330-300s for mid- and long-haul routes. The remaining four A330-300 aircraft joined the fleet in 2011. <laughs> Takeover by Lufthansa Following Lufthansa Group takeover, the regional fleet was changed from Crossair's Embraer ERJs and Saabs to Avro RJs, which are flown by a wholly owned subsidiary, Swiss Global Airlines. The rest of the fleet, apart from the regional jets, was also rationalized and is now mainly Airbus aircraft apart from the Boeing 777, which is operated by Swiss Global Airlines. The airline reconstruction also caused Swiss to renegotiate their supplier contracts, which include ground handling, maintenance, food service, and labor. The shareholders of Swiss received a performance-based option for their shares. Payment will be in 2008, and the amount will depend on how well Lufthansa's shares compare with competitors' shares. Lufthansa continues to maintain Swiss as a separate brand. In 2010, Swiss and Lufthansa were named in a European Commission investigation into price fixing but were not fined due to acting as a whistleblower. On 18 August 2011, Swiss announced a new logo for their company, resembling the logo of the defunct Swissair. The new logo led to vivid online criticism. Within days, several protest groups on social media platforms appeared. Topic. Corporate affairs Head office Swiss International Airlines has its operational headquarters at Euroairport basel Malouz freiburg near Basel, Switzerland. This French-Swiss binational airport is located on French territory and has customs-free access to Switzerland. The Swiss head office is located in the Swiss section of the airport, and it is only accessible from Switzerland. According to the Commercial Register, the legal seat is in Basel itself. The current Swiss International Airlines head office was formerly the head office of Crossair. In 2002, the name Crossair was replaced with Swiss International Airlines on the head office building. As of 2004, the Basel area offices housed about 1,000 employees, while the Zurich area offices housed about 850 employees. When Swiss started as a company, about 1,400 to 1,500 worked at the Basel offices. Topic: Subsidiaries. The following companies are part of the Swiss International Airlines Group: Edelweiss Air, Swiss Aviation Software, Swiss Aviation Training. Swiss Global Airlines merged with Swiss International Airlines ceased operations Swiss Private Aviation Swiss World Cargo Topic <laughs> Customer Services On all intra-European flights Swiss offers drink services Depending on the time of day and the scheduled flight duration Swiss may also offer snack services on shorter flights, cold snacks are offered, and hot snacks are offered on longer flights. The Europe Economy Class services include sandwiches from a Swiss bakery. In addition, Swiss chocolate is provided to passengers prior to landing on most flights. For its Geneva services on Airbus A220 aircraft it uses a buy-on-board system named Swiss Savers. 
However, business or economy flex, classic passengers get a free beverage and sandwich. 2. Swiss maintains the airtrain service, allowing passengers to take any SBB train without extra charge from Zurich Airport to Basel SBB railway station. Swiss previously operated its Swissbus service from Ottawa railway station to Dorval Airport in Montreal for its customers. Topic: <laughs> Destinations. Topic. Code share agreements Swiss International has code share agreements with the following airlines. Topic. Interline agreements Swiss International has interline agreements with the following airlines. Topic. Fleet Topic. Current fleet As of September 2018 the Swiss International Airlines fleet consists of mostly Airbus aircraft Swiss carrier Helvetic Airways operates five Embraer 190 and four Fokker 100 aircraft on behalf of Swiss. Austrian Airlines also operates four Bombardier 8 Q400 aircraft on behalf of Swiss until spring 2019. The Boeing 777 and Bombardier C Series aircraft were operated by Swiss Global Airlines until the subsidiary ceased operations in April 2018. In an attempt to lower administration costs and simplify Swiss fleet structuring, the aircraft fleet has been named after local towns and cities since 2007. The names are featured on the aircraft fuselage, with cabin interiors showing the coat of arms of the town or city. <laughs> Fleet development On the 22nd of September 2010, Lufthansa announced an order for 48 new aircraft, several of them for Swiss. In March 2013, Swiss ordered six Boeing 777-300 ERs. On 12 March 2015, Swiss confirmed that the Lufthansa Group had ordered an additional three Boeing 777-300 ERs for Swiss. The 777s will be operated by, and wetleased back from, Swiss Global Airlines. Swiss has confirmed that all 777 to 300 ERs will have an updated first class cabin with eight private suites and a 32 inch TV, 62 business class seats which convert into a fully flat bed that is over 2 meters long, and 270 economy seats, with 10 seats abreast in a 3 4 3 layout, using the same seat pitch and width on its A330s and A340s on the 777s. The first of these new airliners was delivered in January 2016 and is Swiss's first Boeing aircraft. The Boeing aircraft will replace most of Swiss current A340 aircraft, the remaining five A340s will be refurbished. In 2014, Swiss announced it would refurbish its A320 fleet, with new interiors and the older A320s and A321s will be replaced by A320, A321 NEOS. The A319s, along with Swiss Global Airlines Avro fleet, will be replaced by Bombardier CS300 aircraft in due course. The last remaining Avro RJ100 aircraft, HBIYZ, completed its last flight, LX7545 from Geneva to Zurich on 15 August 2017. Swiss first A220-300 to replace RJ100s plus older A319, A320s entered service at Geneva on 1 June 2017 with its maiden commercial flight as Geneva, London Heathrow. Swiss was the launch customer of the entire Airbus A220 formerly known as Bombardier C Series family of aircraft, with its first A220 aircraft, an A220-100, delivered to the airline in June 2016, registered HBJBA. The first commercial flight it performed was Zurich Paris CDG equals 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 retired fleet